Hi everybody. If you're a beginner on harmonica and you want to play a little bit, let me play it. Or just feel good to harmonica. And you want to maybe do a 12 bar blues. Try this. It's drawing on the second note. Count to 16. Now we'll count to 8 rather and then 8 on the third note blow. Approximately, and then blow on the fourth note, eight bar, eight and eight beats. Go back to the uh, second hole and count eight beats. Into the first hole, um, draw on it and, and count four beats. Then the first hole, uh, blow, then count four beats. Then the second hole, count, uh, draw on it and count two beats. And the uh, fourth hole, blow on it, two beats. And the third hole, blow on count two beats. The fourth hole draw on it, count two beats. And that is a one, four, five blues progression uh, with um, a turnaround. Um, now I have a D harmonica, and I'd probably recommend doing that with a, a C or an A, but my C, uh, C or an A harmonicas aren't working right right now. So I just wanted to do this demo with a D harmonica. And that was uh, with a D harmonica, I was playing what they call cross harp and that was in the key of A and don't worry about what any of that means because all you're doing is picking up harmonica and blowing those notes and further you can do it up here you can um what they call the one it's a one four five blues progression you can um blow on the six hole that's it I cut it up from the four or five to the six That's eight or eight, um, eight beats. That's eight beats down here on the second hole again. So it goes. So that's uh, sixteen beats total, and then to the four hole blow. four beats and then the seventh hole blow four beats or just stay on the fourth hole for uh, eight beats and then go to the uh, sixth hole again for another eight beats And to the fourth hole, draw on it for four beats. Again, one, two, three, four. And to the fourth hole, blow. For four beats. And to the sixth hole, uh, blow for two beats. Two beats. Then to the seventh hole. For two beats, then back to the sixth hole, or you can go to the ninth hole. Let's try that. We go to six, six hole, two beats, seventh hole, two beats, ninth hole, two beats. And then the eighth hole, uh, draw it for two beats. So again, that's the turnaround there, and it's two beats in the sixth hole blow. Two beats on the on the um seventh hole blow. Ninth hole blow, two beats, and then
that's your turn around there. And if you go further up, you, hit the, you can do the ninth hole blow. That's eight beats there. You drop it down to the sixth hole for eight beats. And then jump after the tenth hole for eight beats. And back to the ninth hole for eight beats. Eighth hole, um, uh, four beats. Seventh hole, seventh hole, four beats. That's, um, all the beats in your, um, and plus the eight beats coming up for the, uh, uh, full blow blues. Now the, the uh, turn around again, the beats coming up is a ninth hole, uh, two beats. Fifth hole, two beats. Tenth hole, two beats. And then go to the sixth hole for two beats. Sixth hole, two beats. Eighth hole, two beats. So there are just some different ways to um, do that. Full bar blues and uh, in any key of harmonica, cross harp. And it'll take a while to get the single notes, but you can practice that by, or if you're a chung, by just being on the harmonica and going. <laughs> just putting it on the harmonica, doing that scale. Or the scale. <laughs> I'm betting the second hole draw. That's for the future. It's a uh, bending it, uh, drawing on the one, drawing on the one, and then um, don't blow in the the two, and then uh, hitting the uh, second note for a full set. Dropping that down. I mean, should say half a set. Because it can go all the way down the whole set, so. But it just has to be half a step for this. And then, so you drop that in half a step, and then you um, draw on that second hole, or blow in the third hole. Four. And then that's, uh, um, all the way down to a uh, full set bend on the third hole draw. And then a uh, third hole draw. So there you practice that like that. Or Practice it on the top like that too. Seventh hole blow, eighth hole draw, eighth hole blow, ninth hole draw, ninth hole blow, and then it's the tenth hole uh, blow half set. It's hard to do on the D harp, at least for me. That's your major scale up and down from there. And so to practice that, um, you can learn doing that. And you go back to the idea of um, hitting those other notes to make the 12 bar blues and cross heart.
just always doing all that when splitting up it into a, a bars. One um, doing the first bar. Doing the first bar, uh, drawing the two. The second bar belonging to the three note. Third bar drawing the second note. The fourth bar drawing blowing the third note. And then the fifth bar of the song by blowing the uh, one note. Sixth bar drawing blowing on the side of the fourth note. Seventh part of the song, drawing on the seventh note, on the second note. Eighth part, drawing on the, uh, more on the third note. The ninth, uh, part of the song, uh, drawing on the, uh, first hole, or the fourth hole, whatever. What is the first hole? And blow it on the first hole, four beats, which would be the tenth bar. And then, that's the tenth, uh, tenth bar. The eleventh bar, um, and, uh, the ten and a half would be the, uh, drawing on the, on the two, two, two beats. And finishing up for the eleventh bar would be blowing on the, on the one for two beats. And then eleven and a half would be drawing on the uh, uh, two uh, holes for two beats. And then finishing in the twelve bar is drawing on the first uh, hole for two beats. And that gives us a total of twelve bars on um, in a twelve bar blues, forty eight uh, beats in that. And there you have a twelve bar blues. Okay, so I hope this is somewhat understandable. I know it's not the easiest thing to do, but the thing is that you can have fun with the harmonica if you can learn to play single notes, especially. And you do that by practicing those, those things I just showed you. And, because otherwise, you can still have fun with going. rather be able to control it and have it be separate when you want it. I think you would. I think um, that's important to separate the notes and learn how to do that, and be able to do be what you want to play on. Have play what you want to play on. Okay, y'all, take care. Sorry about.